What up, y'all? It's your boy R to the A to the S. Yes, Ross here with Pacific Cause and Blog. And today I'm here to do a review for God Chasers All the Kings Men uh, CD. Uh, I know y'all gonna ask, am I doing Swoop Album? Yes, I am gonna do Swoop Album. We do just about all the Collision Records review stuff. So you don't have to ask, alright? So, yes, we are doing Swoop. It won't be till later. So when I feel I'm ready, I'll do it. I ain't ready yet. Uh, so I got 12 songs on here, sort of like Swoop Bounds, pretty short, compared to some uh, people's CDs. Uh, I'm not doing this in the order of the CD because, unfortunately, my iPod sometimes mixes up the songs out of order. I don't know why it does that, but it did it this time, so I'm just doing it in the order of my, my iPod. Uh, first song, Where You Are, featuring Ready Rider, Brinson, C Straight, Big Phil. Uh, Ready Rider, he's okay. Uh, not really feeling him. He's, I guess he's all right. The hook is okay. Brinson uh, style is old school on here, man. His delivery is real choppy. Doing that pause rap stuff, man. Uh, C straight. He's probably the best rapper on this song, man. Um, and I like the beat. I like the beat, but I ain't really feeling the song. Uh, next song is Monster Monsters which is Ready Writer. Uh, Ready Writer got some uh, nice wordplay on here. I like the uh, whole Wolverine X Man Michigan line. He had a couple other lines. Uh, this is like an acapella joint. It's straight. Next song is Brent. Next song is Chase Guy Music. Music featuring Brinson, Ready Writer, C Straight, produced by Beyonders. Who that is? I don't. Know. Uh, Brinson on this song he go hard so this is this the, the Brinson I like he go hard on here um, the hook is straight uh, Ready Rider uh, he's good he's good on here and who else who else is on here C Straight C Straight is straight on here no pun intended uh, the beat sounds like Mm, sort of like a KB type of beat. I can see somebody like that rapping over this type of beat. Uh, Cheat Code. Um, the beat, I mean, I'll be honest, I'm not really into dubstep stuff, but I'll make an exception to the song. I kind of like the dubstep on here. It doesn't go to the extreme, but you can tell it's that dubstep stuff. But this is probably one of the better dubstep songs I've heard. Um, I don't like the... Uh, the whole contra thing, the left, right, left, right, left, right, right, left, up, right, whatever it was, man. You know, eh, it was not really that appealing. Plus, a lot of the younger people have no idea what contra, the cheat code is, but nonetheless, unless, I mean, unless they, mama passed it on to them, ain't got no money, you buy no PS3 or something, their mama give them a Nintendo, say, yeah, so maybe they know them, but you know, otherwise, Younger people ain't gonna know what the world this cheat code is about. Uh, but yeah, as far as C Straight, again, he's consistent. I like him on here. I like Brinson. Uh, this is a good song. This is a, this is a good song. Uh, even with, you know, I'm not feeling the hook. Uh, this is actually the last song, but in my order, it's the fifth song uh, that. All Kings Men, the All the Kings Men Cypher. And this is a real cipher because they got a whole bunch of people on here. You got Brinson, Fanatic, David Michael. David Michael, gotta throw the show in, man. From Detroit, so I gotta show love right there. Brother David Michaels, making on the national scene. You got, and I knew, I, I was wondering who this guy was because they said this white boy throwing his hands in the air or something like that. I was like, who was this? He don't sound white to me. And it turned out to be. Uh, the white brother from Detroit, David Michael. You got Ricky. I don't know who that is. You got Javon McKenzie. Javon McKenzie. I, I y'all ain't gonna hear me say this that much, but Javon McKenzie. He got some nice wordplay on here. He ride the beat nice. So yeah, Javon McKenzie is good on here. I, I'm surprised. Um, you got Heavy. I don't know who that is. Ready Rider. Urban D, you got Apple Jacks. Apple Jacks sounds straight on here, so everybody really hold it on, man. I didn't expect the fanatic feature on here, but and then the beat is actually about Brinson God chasing. It's a, it's a good beat. 
the next song on my list is Salute. Uh, it's an old school um, type of style that Brenton had. I'm not really feeling that. I like the rock guitar. Uh, and then C Straight, Ready Rider, they just don't really bring it to me energy ride, so I'm not really feeling this song. I skip it automatically. Uh, the seventh song is actually The Call, and it's really just explaining the gospel, so it's not really to review with that. Can't really judge that. Uh, eighth song on my list is What I'm Living For, featuring Brinson, C Straight, Ready Rider, and Jacob. All right, produced by Smizzy. I don't know who that is. Uh, this is a pop song. Not feeling it. Got a reggae guy on here. It's just too happy, too poppy. Not for me. Uh, Jesus saves. Nice song. This actually surprised me. I didn't. This is like a real street type of song. Uh, you got Brinson Ready Right on here, produced by Beats Nation. I can't really describe it because we don't like people don't really do this type of street beats. Like this, is like an old school like dark beat with a piano to it. Just real old school, not in a bad way either, but just old school in the style. I really like this song a lot. This is one of my favorite songs on here. Uh, and then Brinson does like the hook. He does you know like Jesus save, Jesus save, Jesus save. Now you know play on the. Those of you who know about the old rock group, Red Hot Chili Peppers, give it away, give it away, give it away now, the way you twist that. Um, ten song, uh, Figure Four, Brinson featuring Oatmeal. And you didn't hear me wrong, Oatmeal, that's his name. I don't know why he chose that name, I think he needs to change it. Um, that's my opinion on that. Produced by a guest room. Uh, you can't go to a church and put on a thing, oatmeal, man. People would, you know, they're going to mistake it for oatmeal. You know, you put that on the flyer featuring oatmeal, and the people are like, oh, we're going to have oatmeal. You know, you can't have that as a rap name, oatmeal. You know, you, I, I got a feeling that brother from down south. That sounds like a southern name, all right? But oatmeal, uh-uh, brother. You got to change his name. Not feeling him as a rapper either. Uh, he all off beat. All off beat, brother Oatmeal. Uh-uh. Not feeling brother Oatmeal on this one, man. Uh, but Brunson's straight on here. And the hook is straight, but... Uh, it's really a song I just skipped. Uh, next song I got is Powerball. Brunson featuring Dre Murray. Alright. Produced by AA Day 4000. I don't know who that is. But, uh... I was feeling this beat. This sound like maybe some I don't know, Gucci or Jeezy, one of them down south rappers, trap beats, man. Like when the beat comes on, this is a crazy beat, dope beat. You can just tell right away I was gonna like this. I didn't even know Dre Murray was gonna be on here. Until he kicked the verse, I didn't look at it. I was just like, man, Brenton bringing it hard on here. This is like a real street song, this type of stuff I like, man. Um it's a real hood song. One of my favorites on here. Definitely my well, my favorite on here. And then the last song is Still Want It, featuring C Straight. Um, dope beat. Has sort of a, a, a Drake type of, you know, started from the bottom, that type of feel, you know, like Boy Wonder, 40 type of beat to it. And C Straight is, you know what I'm saying? He dope on here. C Straight is dope, man. Uh, so overall, the, I like more songs on here that I didn't like. I was surprised by that. This is a consistent project. And if you like Brinson, and or even if you never you know, felt Brinson, I would say definitely check it out, man. This is pretty consistent. Surprise me. Uh, this is your boy Roz. Here with Proceed with Carson Ball. Kobe Sussing them out. Chip out.